Has anyone ever corrected you for saying axing instead of asking? Well, history shows us that both are right. Here's why we should keep speaking like we do. Do you say ask or ax? Those who use the latter may have been corrected or shamed out of using it by an elder or a teacher, but linguistic history proves there's nothing wrong with ax. When the S and the K are switched in ask and pronounced as ax or ax, it is a normal process that linguists call metathesis. Language changes over time, and many of today's words were pronounced differently in the past. A few centuries ago, for example, wasp sounded more like wops. For decades, the ax pronunciation was widely used in New England, the Middle States, and the South. Many enslaved people absorbed their speech patterns from white indentured servants who once heavily used ax. It wasn't until the late 19th century that it became a stereotype attached to black English speakers. Some linguists consider ax or ax an integral part of black American culture. Anti-black folks seek to correct our speech to make us feel uneducated and inferior. But we speak a dialect different from standard English speakers and it's never been inherently wrong. We don't have to hide who we are to please anyone. Let's let go of that idea completely. Keep on asking or asking as you please. We all know schools aren't teaching black history correctly. That's why Push Black is so important. Will you support truthful, accurate, empowering black history content with a donation? Click the link in our bio to donate now.